Guys, it got below freezing last night, and I decided I just can't have that. We need to heat things up. Yeah. That's better. All right, guys, Clint here with Classic Firearms. Out here today at Take Aim Training and Range, except, uh, we're not really shooting guns. We're shooting the exothermic technologies, pulse fire, flamethrower, and uh, you, you probably heard why it's called the pulse fire, right? So first off, I just wanna go ahead and throw this out there. You'll notice that there's no added fuel for the burn, right? It's only using electricity right up here. So you'll notice uh, if once we go empty, maybe I can show the spark happening and everything so Ryan's not, you know, in front of this guy while a 25 yard or 25 foot flame is getting spewed out. But anyway, talk about cool. And the days of trying to light your bonfire by just pouring gasoline on it and throwing a match and just keeping your fingers crossed, those days are over because now you can just turn your little button on over here just like this, you'll see that guy right there. Hit that button, that's all you need to do, and make sure that your voltage is somewhere between at least 10 volts to 12, and then you'll know that you're fully charged. Once it gets below 10, it ain't gonna work right. And after that, all you gotta do is push this little button here, and then you'll hear it, and then you'll see it. And uh, Mr. Hanselect is always a great volunteer to be shot at or caught on fire or knifed or whatever else. But anyway, why would somebody need something like this? Well, I've got multiple reasons. Maybe you just have a lot of weeds and everything you need to clear out, that's one. Maybe you just wanna be the cool guy, like I said, at the bonfire, safely of course. And speaking of safety, we do have a fire extinguisher on standby, just throwing that out there. But anyway, maybe it's cold where you're at and now your driveway is iced over and all you wanna do is just melt the driveway. Turn it on, light it up. Oh yeah, and just listen to that clicking, the pulsing. That's pretty cool stuff if you ask me. I think that is a lot of fun. Now, the Pulse Fire too, what I think is really cool about this, there's other flamethrowers on the market that typically use like a propane tank or something like that to try to produce some sort of flame so that way when the gas spits out, it, it goes, right? I'm gonna go step that out real quick. <laughs> We're gonna do a uh, thorough cleansing over here. <laughs> He's not wanting to stop. <laughs> I'm gonna go get that uh, fire extinguisher. Well guys, the uh, fire has literally been put out from uh, Mr. Hanselect here. So uh, I think he's about had it. Let's go find something else to burn. I mean, this thing's great at just getting rid of all the trash you have laying around too. So like I said, it's great for the shrubs and things, brushes that you just don't, brushes, <laughs> brush that you just don't need around the house anymore either. That should work all right for now. Uh, Stoney here, he asked that I actually do this, so I'm not just out here burning people's property, you know what I mean? I am having fun though. <laughs> oh yeah, it's good. But I think we might be getting low here, which actually has me uh, kind of questioning something. Uh, how long will it burn on a complete tank? Let's find out. All right, so how about we just find out how long one full tank will last. Let's just go ahead and get started. I got my stopwatch on my phone here, and then as soon as I hit start, I'm gonna hit the button at the same time. Let's do it. Oh yeah. That is hot. <laughs> And we're starting to die out. Right exactly at 22 seconds is right where I stopped. I can keep going a little bit, but yeah, you can hear the pump working, but that's about it. There we go. And you guys can probably see 
Notice the voltage. You can see that jump right there. How cool is that? Pretty neat. So if you do run out of fuel, at least you have a massive taser you can use, right? So pretty cool stuff, guys. Now, like I said, uh, <laughs> we do practice uh, our firearms and also our flamethrower safety here. So make sure if you guys are using one of these things, you are being safe. Uh, you don't want to set your whole state ablaze or anything like that. So. Uh, yeah, just make sure you're practicing a safe flamethrower techniques, okay? And like I said, this is the electrothermic, <laughs> electrother exothermic, excuse me, pulse fire. Now what's cool about this too is it actually comes already, and I'll show you guys this really quick. Right up here is your battery cap. Go ahead and take this off, and that'll be, that can be completely removed. Well, it gets caught on this little hinge there, which is kind of nice. But anyway, there's your entire battery pack. Right there, it looks kind of like an airsoft gun battery pack, pretty much. Comes also with the charger manual telling you everything you need to know about this guy, but it has a nice little compact station for it, so it gets out of the way completely for you. And uh, yeah, it's ultimately just a really fun device to keep around for uh, <laughs> zombies or whatever else it might be. But typically, and what I see a lot of people actually use theirs for instead of just fun, like I said before, Getting rid of uh, weeds, brush, things like that. If you're to use more of a diesel mixture in here with regular fuel, it'll stick better as well. So if you wanted to actually eliminate some overgrowth or anything, recommend going that route. Or also too, I have seen it, it's not crazy. I have seen people actually dry off their frozen over driveways with the flamethrower. So to each their own, God bless the USA. All right, I think I'm gonna go check the other side of this over here talking about being safe and then we're gonna show our current giveaway. All right, and for those of you that don't know, we at Classic Firearms like to give away a lot of guns. And our current giveaway, well, you might be watching this video in the future, and if you are, our giveaway probably has changed, but that's okay. Just keep coming back to classicfirearms.com. I'm sure we're giving away some other pretty cool gun. But right now, we're currently giving away an HK MR762A1. This is a pure beauty. This thing right now is actually utilized by the United States Army as their designated marksman rifle or their CSAS rifle, which is their compact semi-auto sniper system, which is pretty sweet. And yes, it actually comes in a complete long range package, including a Pelican case, the Vortex Viper PST 3 to 15 by 44 optic, first focal plane MRAD reticle. This thing is so sweet. LaRue tactical QD mount and bipod and Everything about this guy is just sweet. HK's piston driven system also keeps the recoil real light, feeds reliably, and it just keeps on shooting. And I, I actually do want to shoot it. Let's see here, I got a target set up. So I don't know if you guys can tell or not, but uh, this thing's a pretty flat shooter. Sure, there's a little bit of recoil kind of coming back up, but it's more of just like a little love tap. This thing is absolutely sweet. And if you want to see it in uh, a little bit more fun shooting, a little run and gun, uh, go check out our video announcing this as our giveaway. Yeah, this thing is an absolute, mm, it, is, <laughs> it is so nice to shoot, guys. And it is a heavy rifle, though. It's coming in at just under 12 pounds, 11 pounds right in that area. And uh, everything about it, though, is just quality. I mean, it's, it's HK, am I right? I got a couple rounds left. Let's go ahead and dump those. How about it? There we go. Nice. 
All right, anyway, I think I'll go ahead and conclude the video guys, the, the video there. Excuse me, I'm getting all tongue-tied. Oh my goodness, there's so much excitement here with the fire burning and flamethrowers and stuff. But yes, Exothermic Technologies, the Pulse Fire Flamethrower, go check that guy out. It's a self-contained unit, battery, battery charger included, 25-foot flame. Yeah, that's everything that every American needs. And also get your entries in for the HKMR762A1. There is multiple ways, there are multiple ways to get your entries. And uh, two ways we'll talk about right now. Refer your friends, 900 entries right there if they use your referral link. If your friends aren't using your referral links, make new friends. And uh, we also have a code word to get you 400 entries, LRP, more of a code abbreviation, I know. Long range package, exactly what this guy is here. So as always guys, we appreciate you and your business. God bless, we'll see you next time at classicfirearms.com.